Intense discussion during this morning's Panama City Commission meeting. Some residents expressing their concerns about three new homes being built in the Glenwood area. As News 13's Anna Hoffman tells us, the city says these concerns are better taken up with the developer. Panama City residents often say there is not enough affordable housing. But at Tuesday's commission meeting, the complaint wasn't about wanting more, but instead the design. I don't know if the code calls that you, don't, you can build a house without closing. Residents are questioning three new affordable homes under construction on Wilson Avenue in Glenwood. Residents say they're too small, too expensive, and bad quality. They demanded answers from city officials, but Mayor Greg Brudnicki says the city is not in control of this project. We'll you talk, tell us we'll talk off camera and we'll find out who the developer is. Maybe you and me will go see him. That'll be fine. Let's go, I let's don't go care. see him. I'll make it. I don't matter. Anytime you'd like to, okay. call me. Mayor Brednicki says a private developer is responsible for the project. Residents weren't pleased with the response. The city commission approved those buildings down there, and then advice. you knew it wasn't going to be good. Go sit down. Did you? Did you, call did you order. approve for any other call local, order. any other neighborhood? Call to Behind me is the property in question. We reached out to Panama City officials to see what their involvement in the project is, and they say there is no connection. Cypress Community Development Corporation is the developer. A representative from the company tells us these homes will be just under 900 square feet and are similar to the affordable housing the company built in Louisiana after Hurricane Katrina. So with the, you know, the principles of design, which have windows on multiple walls, tall ceilings are deployed to get homes that live as large as possible and feel feel great. She says there is no set price for the homes. When questioned about the quality, she says they're still under construction and there are many improvements left to be made. In Panama City, Anna Hoffman, News 13, Panhandle Strong.